गुड इवनिंग एवरी वन वेलकम टू आवर चैनल फिजियोमैक्स ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड द पार्ट ऑफ एडुकेशनल हब अंडर द पार्ट ऑफ एडुकेशनल हब एंड द रेडियोलॉजिकल फाइंडिंग्स टूडे वील बी सींग एनदर एक्स रे ऑफ द हिप एंड द लम्बर रिजियन सो लेटेस्ट डिस्कस फास्ट वाट इज द सिम्टम्स ऑफ द पेशेंट दिस पेशेंट्स इज हैविंग ए सीवियर डिफिकल्टी ऑन रोटेशन ऑफ द हिप and he is having a severe pain during the squat and the cross leg sitting on the floor that was the complaint for the patient so we had asked the patient to go with a x ray of the spine lumbar spine and the x ray of the hip and today we will be discussing what exactly we can find out from this particular x ray so the first we will see in the lumbar region what is the findings and in this view uh, of the lumbar region we can see this is the l4 and this is the l5 vertebra we can see uh, the si joint lines on both the sides we can see the intervertebral space so if i see the line till l1 to l4 it's uh, normal we can see the spinous process of each of the vertebra in a normal straight line by the time we are seeing the l5 spinous process it's bit tilted so that we can uh, comment that there is a tilt or uh, scoliotic mild scoliotic changes in the l5 that's the uh, fast curvature you can see of that particular patient so he is having a primary scoliosis uh, on the l5 uh, l4 l5 junction if i need to see the other lateral view of the x ray it's a bit uh, normal there is no such change uh, we can see in this except the l4 l5 junction now coming to the hip region as i told the patient is having was having a difficulty and the uh, rotational motion of the hip so that's the reason we have asked the patient to do for a x ray of the hip and here we can see the uh, head of the femur it's got degenerated and we can see the sclerotic changes in the level of each of the hip joints we can see this is the right side hip so we can see the sclerotic changes of the hip and we can see the osteophyte formation also and the head it's quite uh, it's it's going towards osteopenia so and and you can see a mild fusion of the hip joint over here with acetabular acetabular cavity with the head of the femur and th that might be the cause of having the restriction of the hip joint so whenever we we'll uh, we can see the patient is having symptoms of cross leg seating difficulties or squatting there's a need you need to see the x ray of the hip and this is what the findings we got from the patient that the patient is having the degenerative uh, femoral head with the acetabular cavity where there is a marginal osteophyte formation with a sclerotic changes we can see at both the edge of the acetabular labrum and the acetabular edge so this is what's the clinical findings we can see from this x-ray so thanks for watching this video those who are new for this channel don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you